Must suck to be a celestial head just floating around the edge of the universe's stuck toilet. And then parasites move in and build a space station. They start digging out your brains until a death cult evicts everybody and starts blowing up what's left of you. Oh, you gotta be flarkin' kidding me. This carnage brings back troubling memories of worlds I destroyed. Don't suppose Groot knows another side route. If I could just get to the other side, I could hack that thing and drop the bridge. If you can get to the other side, we can get to the other side, and it wouldn't matter. <sighs> Throw me. What? Throw me! Just get muscles to huck me across. Are you kidding? After the fit you threw last time? This ain't like the last time. You all... I trust you guys. Leave this to me! Whoa! Whoa. You are a valued member of this team. Not a tool to be thrown about. Worried about this ritual. And what's really gonna happen if we can't stop it. Ain't gonna be dead people coming back, holding hands and wagging tails, that's for sure. We don't have to worry about that because we will stop it. More specifically, I'm gonna make Raker eat my element guns. Perhaps shooting him would yield better results. And then we're gonna bring my daughter home and that's... That's what worries you. One problem at a time. These Flarknards to even fall for this full Flarkman garbage. Magus demands adulation, trapping you with vile illusion while feeding on your soul. I felt it in my promise, too. That endless hunger. Oh, yeah. Hungry is an understatement. Holy faith! All that light isn't leading to the Cortex. It is the Cortex. How could that mutt let this happen? Looks like you'll get to ask him yourself. This isn't going to end well. Cosmo! We've got to get down there! Don't count him out just yet. I've seen him get out of worse scrapes. Get it! Oh, the beast is being exposed to the promise! Oh, take these off, people! These belligerents do not stand a chance! <clears throat>
You know what I see when I look at that battlefield? I see all of you. I am mesmerized. Seriously, you make me want to fight 24 hours a day. Who's with me? Wise words, Peter Can't Quill. wait to take him down! Let me in! Light him up, Rocket! Nobody kicks a dog on my watch! On our watch! Think like a tree! The mutt better remember us saving his tail here! And the rest of him! Making sure work of these cultist creeps! These deluded souls do not know when to quit! Cosmo! Talk to us here! Flark talking! Use your mind, Scott, to help us out here! That's right! Get on Flark with nowhere, Scott Holes! What are you doing? He's one of them now. He's our friend. Yeah, so is Drax. And I ain't going inside this flea bag's head. Maybe it doesn't have to come to that. Hey, buddy. Are you, uh... <laughs> Take him out. Before it's too late. Wait! He's still in there. I can hear him. I hear only barking. Focus your mind. He's there. Ah, uh, oh, flark it. Just shoot the mutt. No! <laughs> Easy, bud. Friends, remember? He's Peter Quinn. Cosmo knows never lie. Yeah, buddy. It's me. It's all of us. Where is Cosmo smell? The smell of nowhere. Where else would we be? Fur brain. His mind is addled. Or he is simply a dog. He doesn't see us. He's still in the promise. Cosmo, where are you? What do you see? Blue sky. In cars to chase. Cosmo is big. Duma. How you say? Home. He's talking about Earth. Smell of fresh grass. Feeling of dirt between paws. No psychic burden. Just walkies for going. And ball for fetching. If you missed your home planet, could you not simply return at any time? Not a time that matter. Same reason Katavia not go home. Nowhere is your home. Right here and now. Nowhere is nothing. Dead hit. Mind for scrap. It's way more than that. This place is special. I am Groot. If by met you mean I saved your bark, then... Yeah, we met here. It's true. Nowhere was first place since Earth. Cause will not feel like stray dog. First time, Cosmo forget what was lost. This place is a haven for misfits like us. Like you. It's home. Earth is just some rock where you were born. It's not about rock. It's, it's about, about what Cosmo had on rock. Foot of bed for sleeping, belly for rubbing, collar with name. You miss being someone's property? Cosmo not property. Belong to family. Then one day, family gone. Men in suits sent Cosmo into space. Cosmo searched many dog years for those he lost. But yet... You had owners. It sounds like they gave you up. I lost my family too. My mom died right in front of me when I was just a kid. Then Piotr Quill should know. 
Cosmo would work like dog to his family leg. If they are part of this promise, these humans are most assuredly dead. Do not be swayed by the bribe of their return as I was. Promise is only empty until fulfillment be. Perhaps it's Katati who lost hope too quickly. <sighs> Come on, Cosmo, you gotta know this doesn't smell right. Piotr Quill is right. Cosmo human have no smell. They are wicked perversions. You must bite them with all your might. Be gone! Cosmo not fit your eyes. That's it, what do you tell him? Nowhere is Cosmo home be. His pups, his family, will protect it all cost. Sick him, boy! Should we help him? I mean, we may need him. I am optimistic for the beast's recovery. Cosmo's got his mission. We've got ours. Let's get to the Cortex. You think he'll be okay? He's got a thick coat. All right, I still got access codes from when me and Groot were on vacation. You mean when you quit the team? Why do you always gotta be so... Flark! Yep. Drax, can you handle this? An intriguing texture. I fear I will regret this. Just don't start kicking up dust. How do you keep from breaking your hands, smashing through everything? Potathian bone density. But you don't even have cuts on your knuckles. Potathian skin density. Church spreads their faith tech everywhere. It's like some weird disease. I am Groot. Groot says if it's a disease, it's a pretty one. So, stolen codes, jail time. What exactly were you and Groot doing down here before? We got a gig from an old contact at Mantlos before you barged in for a family reunion with Mr. No Lips. Not the weirdest guy I know. You're the weirdest guy I know. What the fork was that? An earthquake? Unlikely. We are not on Earth. Whatever they're doing, I think they just took it to the next level. Wonder if the church even realizes what was being mined down here. They're standing on top of the most valuable resource in the galaxy. The ritual must be starting soon. Are you Good question, bud. How do we know we could even stop something this powerful? <sighs> eh, probably a question for the bug lady. Too bad she ditched us. To save her people. When he was in his promise, Drax said Magus was... Eating my soul. And anything that eats can die, right? That don't sound too scientific. You wish to poison its food supply. Eh, we're the food supply, so... No. We'll kill it the old-fashioned way. Yuck. I am so done with brains in the Universal Church of Crap. Huh. Guardian of Galaxies, Cosmo is owing for short death. Welcome back! Hey, we've got an army of church goods between us and the Cortex. You coming? Yes. Cosmo is retaking power of security, where his cops are hiding. Without power, nowhere is being lost. Gotcha. Be careful up there, buddy. This target requires precision. Yup. If we snuff him out, the rest is cake. Just got no hilarious! 
Thank you, Peter Quill. I'll be your wingman at any time. The bloody my guy is really starting to take me off. I agree. The electric wielding corpsman must perish next. This is a sight of power. A fine place to have it dragged. Bring my own blood. Right with you, big guy. security detail. Gross. That's a lot of brain powder. Yeah, that stuff will turn your airway to sludge. Gray lung, they call it. Good thing I've got my mask. Oh, that won't help. Them particles are so fine, they're already seeping right in. You probably already got the gray lung. Lungs are already gray. And you know that... I have seen them many times. Like somebody's melted gum. Well, for somebody who wants out of here, you're sure doing a lot of hanging around. I can't get back up to the catwalks. There's gotta be something we can use to get up there. Yeah, I'm looking. <gasps> Tracks a little help, Evo. Readily. You can place it there. I am on my way. He wants to know what could have decapitated a Celestial. Likely it was an exceptionally large blade. Ugh, I never want to meet whoever was wielding it. I've been thinking. Yeah, the, the nobodies look out for themselves, but they're also paranoid. That's an understatement. So maybe at the first sign of trouble, some of them jumped in their ships and got out. You underestimate their greed. Riker promises power and eternal life. Mind lifting that up? Where shall I relocate it? It'll look real good right here. Done. What do the buyers do with all of the brain matter? They buy bone scrapes and spinal fluid, too. Why? They're mostly scientists, trying to understand the mysteries of the universe or create the next big weapon. Did you guys know? Oh, yeah. Naturally. <laughs> You're always good for a laugh, Quill. Careful, this place is practically falling apart. Could be all of nowhere, looks like this soon. It'll get back on its feet. The giant head does not have feet. It used to. So they just up and left all this once they discovered the cortex? If by up and left you mean that mutt went barking mad and booted everyone out, then yup. Not surprising. Imagine that thing falling into the wrong hands. We don't have to. Really? Nothing at all? All right. 
Hey Groot, think you can get me up there? I am Groot. Right about there. This seems important to our guys. I want to get a look from up high. Scoping? Scoping? This place smells weird. It's the brains. It goes sour if it sits too long. Smells like metal and... I don't know, something else. Korea. What's that? It's a waste product of a large Katathian slug. I'm not sure slug piss is exactly what I was thinking of. It is unmistakable. Up we go, Groot! You can stop there, thanks! I hunger. For battle? I did not eat on the ship. There's plenty of brain tissue to go around. I can wait. Thanos never tried to take Noah's resources during the war. Don't ever underestimate the Collector's political power. Any ideas, Gamora? I could probably get you up there. What's in all those towers and pods? There ain't no zone in here, so it could be anything. What do you see? Um, same stuff, but higher. to steer nowhere directly into the rift. Can't risk it if Nikki's here. You want to erase the best place in the galaxy? No way! Just browsing, huh? All right, let's go. Oh! Tremors have intensified. That's one way of putting it. It is an accurate statement. Well, it don't help none. For all we know, that thing's about to blow. Oh, what have they done to you? to see all my investments go up in smoke. What investments? A couple seed fundings into illegal weapons research. My baby. Why do the mightiest powers of the universe not intervene against the Church? Galactus, the Stranger, the Living Tribunal. But they didn't show up for the Galactic War either, and we won it without them. You, uh... okay, Rocket? No, I ain't okay. The Cortex, nowhere. What's gonna happen to this place? This filthy dump of cheap booze and shady units is the closest thing I got to a home. This isn't the first time someone's tried to take over nowhere, and it won't be the last. We've still got Cosmo on our side. Once we give the church the boot, he'll whip this place back into shape. <laughs> Hopefully not too good a shape. Thanks, Quill.
what's more dizzying in this place. Looking up or looking down? Do neither. Look your enemies in their eyes. What if I could? Staring down somebody's crotch ain't as effective. Many people living inside our heads, like nowhere. It is a valid question. Many homes are made from wood. Groot, don't listen to the scary man. that thing, group. Hey, don't tell me that. One more time, group. Hey, I can't reach it either. we need to consider. How do we even shut down the Cortex now that it's all supercharged? Yeah, there ain't gonna be an easy off button on that thing. Any chance you can hack it? Uh, we ain't talking about some junky appliance. The Cortex isn't the problem here. It's the Flarknards who've hijacked it. We take them down, and the Cortex is just a machine with nobody at the wheel. You know there is a wheel. I, I saw no wheel. Yeah, there ain't no wheel, but I don't like the idea of just leaving that thing powered up with church scum. We should focus on them faith monuments. I'm betting they all route through the same junction. Here they come! A whole lot of them! Soon to be one less! Kill you. Drax is well 
we have any choice. They shoot, we shoot. Over here. Guess we're climbing brains again. Gotta get across that gap first. Just so you know, I'm reserving the shower indefinitely after this. Pretty unstable. What do you think, Will? All right, Gru. Let's make a bridge of our own. Let's watch out for quakes. Man, I really hope Warlock makes it to the finish line. <laughs> no, Goldie ain't counting on us. To him, we're just a bunch of scut soiling his fancy boots. He's seen what we can do. More importantly, we know what we can do. Right, easy now. So once we get Nikki, we wait for Warlock to catch up. And the Bug Lady. Our plan requires a great many people. Let's just take it one thing at a time. Get Nikki and stop this fulfillment thing. How pragmatic of you. Try not to count my chickens before they hatch. That would be counting eggs. Now is clearly not the time for that. Careful. It gets a little. Whoa! whoa, whoa, whoa! Peter. You want to do the honors? Totally. Watch this. Surprise, Scuttlebuckers! Rocket! Nuke them! Leaves are coming from everywhere! Run! Roar to the plane region! Big trouble! <laughs> 
struggle in vain! This is bringing back war memories! We will give them a battle to rival the Galactic War! Seems pretty tough for an old machine! Goldie didn't finish him off already? I got a grenade with Raker's name on it. Keep an eye out for Nikki. We get her away from these wackos, then worry about finding Warlock, Mantis, and whoever else. I have faith your spawn will be saved, Peter Quill. Let's not use the F word. We're not gonna lose Shh! Everyone quiet! What did they do to the Cortex? Nikki! They strapped her to their Flarkin machine, and they're making the hand direct all the galaxy's faith energy right into it. Fulfillment has begun. We gotta get her out of there, but how? Free the hand, and they lose power. I count four cables. Let's pull them out.
bitches! The hands almost free! Just stay away. This is why I don't have kids. Nikki, this isn't gonna end how you think. Says who? You? I saw what you did. You should want to take it back. I can feel the light inside me. This will be fulfilled. Does she not realize her plan has been thwarted? <laughs> A minor setback. Isn't that right, Grand Unifier? Cortex was meant merely to ease the burden on you, Matriarch. We shall retreat. Please, give me an excuse to kill him. Is this him? The first divine vessel? A pale shadow to your magnificence, Matriarch. Let him watch me do what he could not. I'll draw faith across the entire galaxy myself if I have to. If you think you can hand- I'll handle whatever it takes. Nick. Damn it! Eh, they ain't getting far. I got a tracker on Golden Boy's butt. You what? Yeah, I tagged him back on the bridge in case he ditched us again. We just gotta get back to the Milano. Rocket, don't ever change. Tracker's online. Confirming Goldie's on the Daston Sacro scut. Seatbelts, everyone. We're going in hot. Crap. Hold on. Hold on. Got him! Alpha Herculis system, inside the Keystone Asterism. Got it. Coordinates are in. They're not getting away this time. Power down. Power down. How the flark are we supposed to fight that? Yeah, 
Nova Corps. The world mind must have. Military. Anybody you would have fought back's already here. Playing for the wrong team. Well, can't say we didn't try. Nikki's in there somewhere. There's got to be a way. Yes, we overpower them with our own vastly superior fleet. Well, regrettably, we do not have one. Guys, we do our best work when we're out of options. Somebody's got to have something. Drax. You have royal blood. Perhaps it is time for the Prince of Spartax to return and rally his people. You been to Spartax lately? I have not. But Spartoi technology is well beyond... Spartax was sacked during the war because of its tech. You can't even land there anymore. Rocket, anything? Uh, what about the Ravagers? You could ask for a temporary truce. Yondu's rotting away in the kiln, thanks to me. You could bust them out. Jailbreak the kiln. I'd rather take my chances with the church fleet. I'll bust them out. Yeah, I'd bet on Gamora. As would I. I am Groot. So would I, but it doesn't matter. The rest of the Ravagers scattered during the war. Any survivors are laying low or serving time in one of a dozen backwater planets. Besides, what's a pirate without a ship? <coughs> Groot, and no bad ideas. I am Groot. Yeah, that's a bad idea. We're not going to the Shitari. That is the kind of wild card we're looking for, just not that one. The snakes would shoot us in the back. Assuming they don't shoot us in the front. <laughs> Hold on. What if the answer's been slobbering right in front of us this entire time? This beast cannot operate a ship. That's not what I'm saying. Think about it. Cammy's pretty much useless to us, but she's also useless to the church. They want people to brainwash. I bet animals aren't even on their radar. They went after Cosmo. Cosmo's mind is way more advanced than ours. His intelligence makes him weak to the promise, just like Rocket. Thanks. But not an animal. What I'm saying is we know someone with an entire beast army, and I bet Raker hasn't even looked twice at her. How can you be certain she is not one of them? I am Groot. Guardians of the God! Nope, she's good. You do realize she still wants to flay us and feed us to her babies? Guys, this is it. Okay, our one last long shot. We've got to find a way to apologize and make things right. Okay, well, we'll get her a gift. A peace offering. I ain't going back in a cage. No, no, think bigger. Way bigger. The one beast that she'd want more than any other. Drax knows what I'm talking about. Oh, yes! Oh, no, 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 no. Here it comes! You know where we're going. To Maklu 4! To battle the legendary Fin Fang Foom! say that the rings of Maku 4 perpetually rain fire down upon the godless abominations that dwell below. How fun. <laughs> I'm sure it's worse than it looks, too. It is. Many of my people braved this same treacherous pilgrimage before me, never to return. Systems are overloaded! We are 
destined to crash. Try at least to crash into Fin Fight Foom. Nobody's crashing! Oh, we're crashing! These peaks are treacherous, Peter Quill! I know, I know! Whoa! Clark! Just trying to slow us down! Here, here! Stop yelling! Cersei means all the thing! Clark! Are you cold? No! No! Stabilizers are shot! Repair systems are overloaded! If we are destined to crash, try at least to crash into Finfight Foom! Nobody's crashing! Oh, we're crashing! These peaks are treacherous, Peter Quill! I know, I know! I'm doing my best! Are you? Here, fear! Stop yelling! Fear! Watch out for the thing, Peter! Which thing? Pretty sure she needs all the things! Peter! Watch out for the thing! Yeah, I got it! Oh, Scott! Oh, Scott! Ha ha ha! Glorious! Okay. Oh, a little bumpy, but we're all okay, right? <laughs> Laughing. That's good. It's just, it's perfect. This is us. This is how we park. <laughs> well, this is how Quill parks, anyways. <laughs> we were not made to die this day. Unless, of course, Fin Fang Foom devours us whole. <laughs> hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. We gotta find him first. <laughs> Shall we? <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, this is insane. This is how we park, yeah. <laughs> Whoa, that definitely shouldn't be sparking. We can worry about that after we catch our dragon. And convince Lady Albender to help us bust the church a new one. Before setting out on our quest, let us rouse our spirits with a Katathian battle anthem. What? Like now? You know what? Flark it. Let's do it. Now listen closely. Ancient Katathian is a powerful tongue with words that hold great meaning. Follow as I lead the melody. So traju to pluk, heldagor morgath, sol kath flandergath. Really? We're doing this? Argath go not kol, kol mal ki ultath, go thine kol gal mag. Argath go not kol, kol mal ki ultath, All right, let's do this. Shivering tit witches, it's cold. <laughs> That's not really how that saying goes. You want to correct me? Or you want to find Fing Fang Foom and save the galaxy? I want Fing Fang Foom. And the galaxy-saving thing, I guess. Assuming Hellbender even goes for this. Lady Hellbender will go for it. Okay, well, I ain't seeing no foam poop. We should look for Katathian hunt markers. Testaments to the bravery of those who came before. By bravery, you mean... Glorious death. And what do these hunt markers look like? Like great stakes planted with honor. Oh, oh, the legends of raining fire are true. Any other legends we should know about? Legends of glorious death! Well, as long as it's glorious! We sure will still have a ride home with all
all the meteors? She could take a hit. We literally just crashed because she couldn't take a hit. And she's still in one piece. No, she's in several pieces. Well, the biggest piece is still in one piece. noble way to die on Mach 4, like so many of my people before us. Someone remind Trax we ain't come here to die! No one's dying! We're taking Foom alive! We're handing him over to Lady Hellbender alive! And we're getting her to help us take on the Church's Armada. So in this plan of ours, the Armada part is where we die? <sighs> Maybe, but definitely not before that. Go team! Looks like a dead end. All right, Drax, let's channel some of that excitement toward this rock. I shall pretend it is the head of Fin Fang Foom. Great. Drax just shattered the skull of the thing we're supposed to capture. Bye-bye, Galaxy. You have nothing to fear. They say that his bones cannot be crushed. See? I am Groot. Groot says he wants to take it all in. Take your time, buddy. Might be our last chance to take anything in. You think Foom's in there? Fantasy books taught me anything? It's that dragons love to hang out inside mountains. Groot wants to know if those books said anything about catching dragons. I'm sure it had something to do with teamwork and trust. You can't remember the details because he didn't read the whole thing. I read a lot of different dragon books, okay? And there was always a mountain, and the good guys always win. <laughs> Ain't no one writing a book about us. Does it have big, scary claws? Look, my people were here. Didn't we see these in Drax's memories when Mantis linked us all together? They're Katathian hunt markers. That's a lot of brave Katathians. After Thanos raised Katath, my people were left broken, physically and mentally. Their exodus led many of them here in great numbers. Uh, so how many of these hunters came back? None. They were all victims of Fing Fang Fu? Not victims. They came for the ultimate battle, a truly glorious death. Is it just me, or does it feel like we're a part of something here? Oh yeah, part of Foom's all-you-can-eat buffet. I mean walking in the footsteps of Drax's people, out here to save the galaxy. Makes you want to believe in destiny. I'm not trying to kill the moment or nothing, but everybody listed here was destined to be monster chow. If we all die, we will die like proper Katathians. If we all die, everyone dies. Magus is gonna consume everything. Then let's catch Foom and make sure that doesn't happen. Once told me about a planet he found ravaged by Fin Fang Fu. Okay, team. If we can't make quick work of this thing, then we got no right going after Fin Fang Fu. Put their lights out! Prepare yourself, team! This is like an ice dump version of Stumpy! Perhaps it shares the same weakness!
one fin fight boom. Okay, so on a scale of one to ten, how much bigger and stronger and scarier is Foom gonna be than the thing we just fought? Ten thousand. That's what I figured. No one said this was gonna be easy, Rocket. Right, right. But ten thousand times Quill, Drax is the literal one. Remember? Obviously, our team is going to be strong. Exactly. We all saw what the church is capable of. No matter what this planet throws at us, we're not stopping till we catch Boom and Lady Hellbender is fighting by our side. Need some blade work here. Get a load of them claw marks. It's gotta be Fooms, right? He's even bigger than his legend. So, yeah, uh, when we find him, let's avoid the claws. So, are we sure the Milano's gonna be okay? Because if we end up stranded here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we need to cross here, too. Just not sure how. I could clear the rubble from that ledge, Peter Quill. I just need something to throw. <laughs> how about Quill? <laughs> Come on, it's not so bad. His fleshy frame would make a poor instrument of demolition. Legends say that Fin Fang Foom can will himself from one dimension to another, should he choose to do so. Okay, I'm thinking this is step one of a multi-step solution to get across this chasm. All right, and what are the next steps? Still working on that part. Somebody keeping an eye on the sky? Yes, full of meteorites. Just warn me if you see death coming from above. Incoming! So step two of your plan is crushing us all? I think I see what he's up to. Final step, Drax. If we can topple some of those rocks, we got ourselves a- oh, come on! Glorious! I swear, I've never seen you in such a good mood. Because you have never seen me on the Great Hunt before. What about our quarantine zone mission? You mean our quarantine zone bust? Guys, this isn't just another monster hunt. It is a legendary hunt. No. I mean, we're not here for the monster. Well, we are. But the monster isn't the point. Catching Foom is only step one. So what? Everyone get ready. There's something up ahead. I'm pretty sure it sees us, whatever it is. Great. More food food to deal with. Do not underestimate anything that supplies the perils of this planet. Good advice. Super cool and turn himself in for a good cause! Rocket! Blast him! Yeah, well, what have I told you about always bringing a star? Cut to the chase! Hope none of the meteors fall on us right now! Wouldn't mind one hitting some of these worms, though! At this rate, I'm worried we won't have time to save Nikki! She don't want to be saved, Quill! And the hunt for Fin Fang Foom continues. Okay, let's just think things through a moment. Since when is that a thing we do? What if we're too late? What if Raker finishes what he started and the ritual... Then we're doing all of this for nothing. Not for nothing. If our final act is to challenge Fin Fang Foom, it will be an honorable final act. Eh, I don't do final acts. I'm a survivor. So we're not too late. All right, let's figure out a way to get through here. We're in a rush, apparently. There. See? More... ominous peaks. This planet's starting to give me the creeps. I keep thinking Foom's gonna claw us from behind. Fin Fang Foom is a legendary beast. Legendary beasts do not claw from behind. Maybe not. Smart ones do.
Stretch up, buddy. Thanos would have loved this planet. Fang Foom uses the planet's treacherous surface to test would-be adversaries. Uh, Lady Hellbender legends all over again. Well played, Kakaranthara! How do you know? Hello? She's an assassin? I bet she's gassed all kinds of famous people. So here's an idea. Why don't we lure Boom into one of these gas caves? Knock him out. Cowardly. I want full credit. For the last time, Drax, we're not killing Fin Fang Boom. We're catching him to give the Lady Hellbender so she forgives us and hopefully helps us fight the church. <sighs> Seems complicated. galaxy at stake. I ain't gonna hold it. Wow. I'm impressed. You really conquered it here. Strength, Drax. Stand back. I'm thinking no. Right in the face. 
Haste! Dig! Caution! That looks like a good spot. Since you ask. <sighs> This is definitely in Drax's wheelhouse. Resilient and a boulder. I know. I'm just trying to be positive. Why? I think it's a team building thing. We require no further team building. Honestly, after everything we've been through, there's no one I'd rather be doing this with. I flarkin love you guys. Uh, gross. <laughs> Trying to be positive. Why? I think it's a team building thing. that long. Peter, look! There's smoke ahead. Galmak, Galmak, Solta Flandergoth! Boom! It's boom! Yes! Or going, keep going! Like you flarkin' rock! Yes! Or yeah, Ominous is right! Pell muffin sardu, jud kind of. That's a lot of guts to fight! 
My skin is so resistant! Foom, you seen him? Big wings, nasty teeth, purple shorts. What do you mean, purple shorts? What, I heard he wears purple shorts. Ancient legends do tell of such a thing. See? this one. <sighs> Let's see those things in action. I'm on it. I swear, Quill, you get all the fun toys. What? What about that weird gun you have that turns people inside out? And that one. It ain't quite as cold in this cave. You're the one with fur. Dude's practically naked. I am so jealous right now, Quill. You should be. We got past your fear of water. I can't jump. It's like this magic mud stuff I used to make as a kid. There is nothing magical about mud. You haven't been to the spa in Contraxia. I have not. You don't strike me as the spa type. Like I said, magical. Smiles upon us this day, my friends. We just almost got crushed by a giant meteor. Indeed. Almost. He's got you there. How do we get across this gunk? Perhaps we can leap to the ledge above. I wouldn't hold your breath. Oh, of course not. Steady breathing is essential to an effective leap. Aside, mortals, and allow the Meltinator to do his mighty work. That's a terrible name. Huh? Got a better one? PD Hot Guns. No! Captain Fireball. Not even a fireball. It's more like a uh, heat blob. Captain Heat Blob. Nope, no. They've saved us three times already. I mean, how did you know they'd melt that ice wall? Oh, uh, I... 
So we could have just as easily died horribly. Yep. Group, a little help? Just about there. to communicate. Please don't. Star-Lord! See? <laughs> Star-Lord! Star Is it just me, or did he sound a little irritated? No, nope, there was definitely hatred in that voice. <laughs> Always the charmer, Quill. is beautiful. Check out these pointy trees. Don't check them out too closely. Groot says watch out for those plants with all the holes on top. <clears throat> those things grow in a frozen hellscape. I think they're made of sturdier stuff than that. Ah! It burns! <laughs> Groot says they've got corrosive spores. Maybe don't get too close. Keep your eyes peeled. Smell an ambush. Your senses must be finely tuned. I smell nothing. We are clearly still being stalked by the snow beasts. They ain't exactly subtle. When to go? A vacation. Preferably on a normal planet where nothing's trying to kill us. Look, Will, it's your new best bud. I'd say communication has failed. Another up there. Why can't we ever just 
Nice local! What can I say, Quill? You bring it out in people! I'm on it! Let loose, Rocket! <laughs> 